Why does my Streamlabs OBS keep disconnecting? Fixing the Streamlabs OBS disconnecting problem ensures smooth streaming and uninterrupted viewer experience. One of the reasons why this is happening is because your streaming settings does not match with your internet speed. In my case, I already know that I have way above average internet speed, so I can just guarantee that this is not something that I'm going to experience. But basically, I'm going to show you how to set this up. So in here, you can see that I have 230 Mbps for the upload speed. Upload speed is going to be the most important thing that we're going to be basing for this one because we are going to be streaming, we're going to upload it, and people who are going to be watching it are going to download it. Now, in order for us to check how much is the requirements for 1080p, you can just go ahead and Google that one. 1080p streaming internet speed requirements. So there you go. So according to ACT FiberNet, it says here that if you are going to stream 1080p, you will need a bandwidth of at least 5 Mbps, but best speed for seamless 4K streaming is at least 25 Mbps. Now it says here that for 4K streaming, 25 Mbps is just a requirement. Again, in my case, I have here 230 Mbps, which is way over that one. Now just because you have way over that speed, you can just go ahead and stream in higher resolution because your audience are also going to suffer, especially if they have slightly slower internet speed. As I've mentioned earlier, you are going to be uploading data while your audience are going to be downloading them. So for the best practice, I recommend streaming somewhere from 720p and 1080p. Now once that's done, we're going to go ahead and open our Twitch broadcasting guidelines or any broadcasting guidelines that you are going to be using where you're streaming but basically twitch is going to work for everything um, i'm going to scroll down here and i should see something like this so say for example i'm going to be streaming for 1080p 30 fps so this is the things that i'm going to be following in here so i'm just going to open my stream labs right and i'm just going to put it aside all right there you go so what we're going to do is head over to the settings and here in the settings we're going to go to our output you can see that under the video bitrate, I have here 2,500. However, the recommended bitrate for 1080p 30fps is 4,500. So I can just go ahead and change that one. And then for the software, this is actually my software or the CPU. I'm going to change this one to my graphics card. And then audio bitrate, you can change this or you can just leave it at that. Another thing that we are going to do is head over to video. So this one here. So video, I have here set my base canvas. This is actually my computer and also my output resolution. They are just the same. Now, once everything is done, you can just go ahead and click this one here. I have set the FPS type to common FPS values and set it to 30. Now, this is also something that I'm going to tell you guys. Go ahead and open the advanced tab and just and then scroll down here below. You will see that here I have the settings automatically reconnect. I have enabled it. And for retry delay, I'm going to set this one to one second. And then here, maximum tries, it means that once I get disconnected, it will retry to reconnect for that number of times. So I'm going to set this to 25. All right, and then under network, you can see here dynamically change bitrate when dropping frames while streaming. So basically what is going to happen is that if there is some changes in your internet speed, the bitrate is also going to change. This is going to affect your stream for a bit, but the important thing is that you will not be disconnected. Now, once that's done, you're just going to go ahead and click done here. And there you go. You can just go ahead and start streaming. And congratulations, everybody. That is how you're going to fix your stream labs if OBS keeps on disconnecting. And by the way, I would highly suggest to upgrade to Streamlabs Ultra to level up your streaming quality and experience. You can save up the $10 of discount right away after clicking on the link in the description box and the comment section below. And as always, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and leave this video a like if this helps you out.